Now let's go to the briefcase section of research. So we're in research and we go to briefcase. Now briefcase is your headquarters for your SEO strategy. Now this one is essential to managing your SEO strategy because here you will have all of your opportunities, the best opportunities that you found using the keyword research tool. And you can organize all of your keywords based on awareness stage, decision stage, buying stage, and other stages that you may plan for on your customer's journey. You can save direct keywords, indirect keywords, core keywords, secondary keywords, and there are lots of things that you can do. Of course, uh, we also have lots of guides and lessons so that you can understand what these mean. And here are some ideas, message frameworks, organizing campaigns, mapping customer journeys, conversion focused, indirect targeting, latent semantic indexing uh, for branding. And there are tons of ideas on how to use briefcase to better organize and manage your SEO strategy so that even if you work alone, uh, you'll always get a quick glimpse uh, into how you're trying to rank uh, your certain website. And if you're working with other people as well, this will definitely help them. Now, we can see that for the keyword Hermione wand, which is labeled with orange, which is my label for wands. We can see that the Hermione wand uh, is used in one post on this website. And it also has a page that has been ranked on Google for this particular keyword. Now I can also click on keyword info and I can see that the country's US, the competition not hard to rank. So the way we look at competition is we're trying to identify what are the chances that your website will manage to actually rank top 10 for this given keyword, considering all the competition out there who's struggling to get ranked for the same keyword. And it looks at a lot of different metrics. It's all powered by our market intelligence feature. And instead of giving high competition, low competition, we actually tell you the chances that you have to rank for that keyword. Now the search volume is, is quite large and you can see that it's got a good trend. And this is stuff related to recent social media discussions, but it's not interesting for us right now because with this website, I only care about pure SEO on other websites. If I had something like, let's say, uh, Upworthy, then I would definitely care about SEO and also social media power because recent discussions means a lot of social media powers and a lot of traffic if I would, you know, display this on social media, right? So this is all part of my strategy. You can see the keyword, how often I've already used it so that I can better organize my keyword portfolio and what rankings they have. And here at the blue button, you can see that I can send this to the live assistant so that I can begin creating a page or optimizing my existing page uh, so that I reach higher optimization for this keyword. I could send it to rank checker so that the squirrely system begins uh, finding out where this keyword and where my page using this keyword is situated on the Google search ranking pages. Then I can refresh the research if I want to bring in new data about this particular keyword, or I could assign a label to it. Let's say that I said that this is once, and it's also a direct keyword, or it's something related to content ideas, or keywords that work in another similar game to this one. All right, so I, I could definitely uh, choose other labels. And now if you look through all of this, you can see the whole strategy that we currently have for this website. And of course, because this is part of strategy and strategy is important, I can always download backups of my data of everything that I have stored in briefcase. I can download the backup and I can restore it on this site or on a, or on another site that I own so that all the data will just go back in and I will never lose the keywords that I've worked so hard to find and to organize. So Hermione Granger wand, all right. This is also very green. Uh, you can see that these are just oranges these are not very good. These used to be good keywords, but now there's uh, too much competition. See, very hard to rank, even though the search volume is huge. A few months ago, this was the perfect keyword because it has a very big search volume. The trend is going up and it was very easy to rank. Now it's very hard to rank because a lot of players 
have gotten into this industry. And that's why it helps every now and again to click the refresh research button and make sure you have everything ready. And for example, wizard wand or custom Harry Potter ones, no research data. So let's click this and go. This is a relic from the older versions of Scrolly SEO, but in case you get this, you can go to the research. Click next, next. The research. Oh, we do not have any data for this keyword at the moment. Otherwise it would have shown up. So sometimes you can't really find keywords. Um, so it's definitely a relic from the old Squirly because this site used to have the older versions. You can see that oh, this is still easy to rank. This is a really great keyword to go for when it's Harry Potter AR game coming out and it's got a very good search volume. And you can see a lot of a lot of other great keywords like Hufflepuff merchandise, best Ravenclaw characters, good for ranking, search volume is pretty decent. This one is really good for ranking. And you can see other ideas here and you can navigate and once you've decided, you can, of course, optimize for this one, create articles, create pages, focus pages, new products in your e-commerce store. And you can manage all of this from research and briefcase. Okay, so this was the section that I wanted to uh, talk to you about.